the wall uh, in this video we'll see how to run can lock in replay block uh, that is also called how to uh, run can lock in online mode so before that let's take one example you are in a car and you are playing with your infotainment system so let's say from infotainment system home screen uh, and you want to play one song so you have launched uh, uh, you have selected usb audio and you are playing uh, a song then you have switched into fm tuner then uh, then again you have switched into uh, you have connected android to carplay android to either android or carplay okay and then system got reset and all all those scenarios are stored in the logs so when developer uh, analyzed uh, those logs so how can you how can he know he knows that uh, issue so uh, using this replay block he can uh, easily uh, do so what he will do he just uh, uh, play head logs in replay blocks then uh, then all what are scenarios you have performed in uh, your input in system it will actually display in, uh, at their end so uh, yeah, on connecting carplay system got reset so he will get to know that uh, yes uh, on connecting carplay so means uh, there is issue in carplay logs so he will uh, see those uh, android auto uh, related logs only so here uh, how to add replay block i will i uh, will uh, tell you first uh, using two ways you can add either through this uh, network mode just select right click and then insert replay block or top right corner and then select replay block then select right click insert replay block then uh, after adding replay block just select configuration right click and select configuration so here uh, replay, uh, replay name so i am going to tell uh, i am going to write uh, replay name is demo demo block then source file name source file means our logs so uh, here i have uh, saved my logs in can log sample can file and event so this is ascii uh, file type which i have downloaded from uh, google so you can also download and see so after adding source file uh, it will display like this or you can also uh, change its uh, see the logs how it uh, displays like this so uh, and keep all the uh, setting as a default start timing condition immediately just check select this it, it is in default mode you don't uh, change this one so once you start uh, or press f9 from here so uh, immediately uh, your uh, logs will be uh, it will be played and here channel mapping you can select uh, uh, source type or target type so here uh, basically here source uh, uh, it comes can one and target is also can one so just keep it as it is don't change anything and then select okay so here you can see event dot ascii or file type uh, our logs has imported and when you select f9 so uh, whatever scenario you have performed it will be displayed in your systems so by using this way you can add your uh, can logs or uh, you can run in uh, your logs in online mode 